about the ruling on accepting a Christmas gift. Now, as Muslims, we know that we are not allowed at all to celebrate Christmas, New Year's, Halloween, Easter, uh, whatever. These are related to other religions, to other customs, and they're not related to our religion as Muslims. We are only allowed to celebrate two feasts, two Eids, the Eid of Al-Fitr, which comes after Ramadan, and the Eid of Al-Adha, which comes in the season of Hajj. But what is the ruling if someone on their festival, they share a gift? Some people would react violently and they would be so nervous and agitated. No, this is not permissible. This is haram. This is kufr. This is blah, blah, blah. And this is wrong. The Prophet وسلم, would accept a gift. So if they give you a gift on their Christmas or on their New Year's or on their pagan um, festival, accept the gift. This is part of being kind. You can give to them a, a similar gift later on with the intention of softening their heart to Islam. Now, I did not celebrate with them. If, for example, my birthday is on the 23rd of November. So someone sends me uh, a 10,000 riyals check. Let, let's make that in pounds, it's more. And I would not reject it and say, no, this is haram, you're celebrating my birthday, it's a gift. I did not throw a party, I did not accept an invitation to a party that he threw, but rather he gave me a gift and I accepted it. So this is totally halal, there's nothing wrong in that. Now, what is haram is, that if on their feasts, on their days of celebration, they give me food that contains meat. Meat, we are only allowed to eat halal meat, and most likely this meat was slaughtered not for the sake of Allah Azza wa Jal, but for that festival, and hence we cannot eat it. But if they give us candies, if they give us vegetables, if they give us uh, a pen or a car or a whatever, in this case this is permissible, inshallah. We have a